name is Ben Gruno. We're down in Punta Arenas, Patagonia. We're here with the new S-Line and we're shooting a bunch of stills of these guys. I could be shooting them tracking at six frames a second or if I was manually focusing at nine frames a second, but we've got something in here called 6K photo mode. What 6K photo mode is, is shooting 18 megapixel stills at 30 frames a second. It's super handy when shooting wildlife, any sort of action sports like that. I'm gonna show you guys how to set up 6K photo mode. What we're gonna wanna do is hit the menu button. And once we're in the menu, we're gonna toggle up to the camera and we're gonna hit over, toggle down all the way to the last page, toggle over to the right, and then just about halfway down in the middle, we've got 6K, 4K photo mode. We're gonna set that and go inside there. Once we're inside there, we've got picture size and burst speed. So we can shoot 6K, 18 megapixels. We can shoot 4K, eight megapixels. And then we can also shoot 4K at 30 frames a second, eight megapixels. We have a couple different record modes in here. Just the regular burst is while you hold down the shutter, it's just gonna keep bursting as long as you keep the shutter open. We also have a press shutter to start and stop. So basically you just press the shutter and that will start the 6K or 4K photo mode and you press it again and it will stop the sequencing. And then we also have a pre-burst mode. So it will basically record a second before you shoot and a second after so that you can actually reclaim what you're doing. The pre 6K photo mode is a burst setting that actually has the electronic shutter open and it's constantly recording. And when you do press the shutter button, it will take everything from the last second before and record it and then also the second after. Here we have a sequence that was recorded in 6K photo mode and that one looks good. So I'm gonna hit the menu button on the back of the camera and it's gonna ask me if I wanna save that image. I'm gonna say yes. It's gonna process that image and then spit it right back out onto the card, either XQD or SD that I've got in my card slot. And that way I also have the original sequence. I can always go back and save another photo if I want to or edit them all in post. This way I've got another copy of it on the camera roll ready to go. Really psyched to be down here in Punta Serenas and come up rolling up on these kids. They're really killing it. Thank you guys for watching Adorama TV. If you have any questions or comments, please down below.